Hey guys. So I'm back again and it's come full circle. So we've, oh, look at that. That's six cannon rounds firing straight ahead. So this is the USS Ohio, or it's not the Ohio, dumbass. This is the USS Omaha. It's the tier five US cruiser and it is one of the best ships in the game for its tier. It's, I had a hard time believing that I could have more fun in a ship than I was having in the Phoenix. I've found a ship that I honestly like more than the Phoenix. So with the St. Louis, you are pretty slow at only 23 knots. You're one of the slower ships in the game. You have a very respectable health pool. Speaking of the St. Louis, St. Louis right there with his 2,900 health. I only have 2,300 health. So yeah, despite the fact I'm two tiers higher, he actually has quite a bit more health. But I have substantially more armor, so I take a lot less damage per hit. And we're going to see just how much damage this poor little cruiser can take. <laughs> oh, this poor little guy. But, so, you know, you start out with the St. Louis at tier 3. It's your first proper U.S. cruiser. It has an 8-gun broadside. Then you go up to the Phoenix and you lose three of your broadside guns. And you lose quite a bit of health, but you pick up a crap load of speed, becoming one of the fastest ships in the game. And you pick up three torpedoes per side. Now, you're at the Tier 5 Omaha, and I have to say, while it does feel like the Phoenix is worse than the St. Louis at first until you learn to appreciate the speed, jumping into the Omaha, it's all better. There is Well, once you get it fully upgraded, there is nothing that the... Phoenix does better than this ship. This ship is a much better ship than the Phoenix, which I was not expecting because I didn't think anything could be better than the Phoenix. But this ship absolutely is. It takes you back to the full 8-gun broadside of the St. Louis, so you have the same firepower as the St. Louis now. You're no longer compromised on firepower. The St. Louis is one of the heaviest hitting cruisers until very high tiers, so you're finally able to bring that same insane gun firepower back. Um, does it sell with torpedoes? It doesn't just still have the three torpedo tubes per side, it actually has six torpedo tubes per side when it's fully upgraded. I'm stock right now, so I only have four, but when you get it fully upgraded, you have six torpedo tubes per side, <laughs> because three's not enough. So it has, oh, speaking of a St. Louis, St. Louis. So I saw this St. Louis in the beginning of the match, making a beeline for this side of the map. I then thought, hey, it's going to be a lonely St. Louis all on his own. I'm going to go club him to death. And just because he has almost double the health I have left at this point, <laughs> I still have significantly thicker armor, so he's not going to be able to damage me as easily as I'm going to, as easily as I'm going to be able to damage him. So I'm just going to start hammering him. We have the same guns, but I have more armor, so I, in theory I should win this. And I'm going to start trying to put my speed to use to close in, possibly get within my 5.5 kilometer torpedo range, force him to turn so he can't get all eight guns at me, but we'll see. We'll see how it works. We're going to try and win the gunnery duel right now. Two other things that you'll note. There is a friendly St. Louis coming to help me, but other than that, I'm entirely on my own. And there are three other enemy cruisers, two of which are now firing on me, also coming around the island. So I'm right now in... <laughs> I'm not looking at them because I'm focusing on the St. Louis, but I am now in a four-on-one. And our St. Louis is going to be here in about 40, 50 seconds. And then it's going to be a two on four. So it's going to go from bad odds to not so bad odds. But it's still pretty bad odds. So, eh, could be worse. I mean, I am. He's at less than half health. And he's taken about a third of my health off. And he knocked out my steering and my torpedoes. So I can't actually repair. It's going to be over a minute before I can repair. So I can't steer anymore. Oh, well. Fire. This ship has really great gun coverage. It has at least six guns in every direction, so it's not that big a deal that my steering's been knocked out. And I'm going to throw some torpedoes at him for the lulls. I wasn't really paying attention to how little health he had. If I realized how little health he had, I wouldn't have wasted the four torpedoes. And again, it would be six torpedoes if I wasn't stuck. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just going to finish him off with my guns, and now we're going to turn to deal with the other three cruisers. And that... Uh, the friendly St. Louis has done one hell of a job, almost finished killing that uh, cruiser, cruiser. And first, I'm going to deal with this cruiser because he's close enough. So look, it's a full health cruiser. And check it out. It's a no health cruiser. Just, it's that fast. 
that fast. And uh, now I'm going to steal the kill on this guy. So we're going to call that the St. Louis's. It's my kill because I right there just got the kill. But we're going to call that the St. Louis's kill anyway because he did almost the entirety of that cruiser's health and damage. With that said, I got the other cruiser entirely and I took the St. Louis entirely. Speaking of St. Louis, look, it's another St. Louis. So I killed a full health St. Louis entirely on my own. I then killed a full health whatever that other cruiser was on my own while the St. Louis was killing that one cruiser. And now we're both going to take about half the health off this guy. Oh my god, I love this ship. <laughs> and it's stock. It's stock. And I'm loving the crap out of it. So you have the same insane firepower of the St. Louis. You have truly incredible torpedo firepower. They're still the 5.5 short range torpedoes. But they're, they're good torpedoes. They're good short-range torpedoes. And besides, the reason this ship has torpedoes is to deal with battleships. And if you can one-shot if you can one-shot cruisers with it, that's nice too. Speaking of one-shotting cruisers with torpedoes, I love torpedoes. I really do. <laughs> oh, get crapped on. Even though the, the torpedoes did almost nothing. My guns would have finished them in a few seconds anyway, so... I just got four kills. Again, one of them was that St. Louis is we both co-killed that guy, but I took the other two pretty much on my own. I love this ship so much. It's stock. It's stock. And the St. Louis, they have more health. They have the same guns. It just doesn't matter because this ship's just better. So it actually isn't better than the Phoenix in every way. It's one knot slower. It'll only do... When it's fully upgraded, it'll only do 34 and a bit knots. Well, the Phoenix will do 35. But one knot to be just so much better in every way. I love the crap out of this ship. So I'm going to go get it fully upgraded. And then I'll bring you some nice gameplay footage of it. Fully upgraded with all of its glory. So I'll see you guys next time. Oh my god, the Omaha. It's... I cannot over-recommend it.